us may well live till we're 90 and our children may well live till they're 100. And this is a profound change for us as individuals and as a society. While it does bring challenges and certainly the government tends to focus on the challenge of pensions and funding the NHS and social care, actually there are huge opportunities and potentially later life can be a time for being healthy, being active, contributing to communities. But unfortunately, because of inequalities, too many people are missing out on that opportunity at the moment. Older people are a huge asset. You know, they're indirect economic contribution to society, whether that's as an unpaid carer, estimated to be worth about 11.4 billion per year, as grandparents, estimated to be 7.3 billion per year, uh, in terms of volunteering, 6 billion per year. So despite these amazing contributions, older people are often made to feel a burden. We have seen this, this uh, big demographic change, intergenerational issues uh, uh, playing around, and, and, and the state increasingly receding and, and asking people to, to, to make their own arrangements to look after themselves uh, and for their well-being. The system is not really ready to look after for, for uh, people living longer, and also that, that group, age group, uh, uh, constituting a higher proportion of the population. They, they are vulnerable in, in, in many ways in terms of uh, income they receive uh, through pensions, uh, but also increasingly the health services they get because as, they, as people get older, they require more social care, health services, and we need to look at ways of uh, dealing with that. So the Centre for Aging Better has a partnership with Greater Manchester Combined Authority and we're very excited about the potential for Greater Manchester to become the first UK age-friendly city region. We think that there is a real opportunity with devolution and the opportunities that Greater Manchester has to really make a difference, so whether that's through transport systems, through housing, through health and social care or skills and lifelong learning. Greater Manchester has the opportunity to really make a difference. Thank you.